Welcome back party people. My name is Daryl Wilson and today I'll be showing you guys the best free plugins for 2021 and beyond. Now this video is going to be a little different than my other videos. It's almost impossible to say that one plugin is the best for the entire category. So what I've done is I've picked 20 different categories and picked the best free plugins and alternatives to use for that specific category. This way you guys can pick a plugin that works for you and your WordPress websites. Cause I realize everyone has their own style and preference of what they want on their WordPress websites. Now this video took me around two months to make because I spent a long time testing out dozens of free plugins to bring you guys the best plugins that I came across. So make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And with that said, let's go ahead and get started with this video. So number one, SEO. The Rank Math plugin is a free plugin that allows you to index your website in the Google search results. The Rank Math plugin has really grown in popularity over the year, and you'll be able to submit your website to the Google Search Console and also optimize your pages and posts using this free plugin. The free version is pretty generous and offers quite a bit. Alternatively, you can use Yoast. Yoast is another free plugin that allows you to optimize your pages and posts in the Google search results. They're both really easy to use for beginners and you should not have a problem getting your website set up for the Google search results. Number two, image optimization. Now the tiny JPEG plugin is the number one rated online service to optimize all of your images through their website. Yet tiny JPEG has recently created a plugin of their own that allows you to optimize your website within the WordPress dashboard, making it really easy for you to shred off all the fat on the images on your website. You will have to sign up and register your API key in the plugin settings. You can also visit their website and optimize your pages manually without even using the plugin. I've tested TinyJPEG and it's a great free solution to optimize your images without Photoshop. Alternatively, you can also use Resmush. With Resmush, you can simply click a button in the back end and this plugin will start to shred the fat of all of your images, making your website run faster. It's another great free plugin that allows you to reduce the size of your images without Photoshop and it's completely free. Number three, translations. Now Translate Press is great. Translate Press allows you to convert your entire website into a different language with a single click. Translate Press offers a few different ways to translate your website. You can use Google Translate or you can translate each word or phrase to any other language. You can also use the Deeple Translator located on their website if you need help. The pro version allows you to translate your website in multiple languages. Alternatively, you can use Polylang. Polylang is another great free plugin that allows you to translate your WordPress website. It uses a plugin called Lingotech to help with translations. The free version gives you enough power to translate your whole websites. The pro version allows you to duplicate your posts in different languages and slugs as well. Both are great choices for a multilingual plugin. Number four, push notifications. Push notifications are trending with one signal you can send up to 10,000 push notifications for users who allowed push notifications on your website for free. You can also create segments for specific audiences. Another cool tool is you can send push notifications when you upload and create products to help maximize sales on your e-commerce websites. You can also use push engage. It does have a small limit of push notifications in the free version. However, it does offer an unlimited plan, which is pretty attractive. Number five, contact forms. I think the best contact form as of right now is Forminator. Forminator is a really simple contact form builder that makes your contact form look really professional. With Forminator, you can customize each section, add built-in payment gateways, also in the free version, and it also comes with conditional logic. This contact form offers the most features I've ever seen in a contact form versus any other free contact form. If you're looking to add a contact form to your website on a budget, definitely check out Forminator. It offers tons of features in the free version. Number six, caching. Today, most people are using Lightspeed servers. The Lightspeed caching plugin is a great plugin that works specifically for your web server. You can cache specific parts of your website like the CSS, the JavaScript cache, and the critical CSS cache. Plus, you can refresh the caching settings on your website. It also comes with image optimization and a database optimizer as well. It pretty much has everything you need for your caching needs. You can also use WP Rocket. I personally use this plugin on my WordPress website. However, it is a paid plugin. It's a great caching plugin that offers great caching features. It also comes with features like lazy load, CDN integrations. I really like this plugin and I personally use it on my WordPress websites. Number seven, spam. 
your website is gonna get spam. Trust me, I get offers for Viagra, I get offers for all sorts of crazy products. I'll make this quick. Clean Talk is the best one I've used that actually works. Clean Talk has a collection of spam organizations and automatically box the entire organizations known for spam. It really works. The filtering system is very accurate and I've blocked thousands of attacks with this plugin and I personally use this plugin on my WordPress website. Number eight, analytics. If you wanna record your analytics or even see your ad revenue, Google created a new plugin called the Google SiteKit plugin, which will connect your WordPress website with your Google Analytics. So when you log into your WordPress website, you will see all the analytics on your dashboard right away. You can also use the GA Google Analytics plugin. It does some of the same free features and allows you to view your Google Analytics within your dashboard. Number nine, backups. Backups are important. The worst thing is when you wake up and see your website gone or see you got hacked by on your WordPress website, which actually happened to me. All-in-one WP migration is probably the easiest backup and migration plugin that WordPress has to offer. You simply install the plugin and export your website as a file or upload a copy of your website to other cloud drives. The free version offers the file export option, which is probably the most important, and you can always upgrade to the pro and export a copy of your website to specific drives. You can also back up the records of the comments, revisions, the library media, and other records the website might have in the database. It's a great plugin, and most people will find it very easy to back up and migrate your WordPress website. You can also use Updraft. Updraft is one of the most popular plugins that can back up your website and restore it to a previous state. You can also clone your website and migrate it to another domain. Number 10, page builders. Now this is gonna be a fun one. This is where everyone likes to fight and get rowdy, but hey, that's okay. Now there's no specific best page builder. However, I do feel that whatever works best for you is the builder that you should choose. Number one, Elementor. Elementor is probably the most stable page builder with tons of integrations. It does have a small learning curve, but after just a few hours of using it, you'll be able to make websites with ease. It also has a massive market of templates, plugins, and themes. So no matter what kind of website you're trying to build, you can probably build it with Elementor. Number two, Brizzy. Brizzy is one of the most intuitive and easiest page builders to use on this list. It comes with beautiful pre-made sections that you can simply click and go and have your website up and running in a few clicks. It does have less integrations than Elementor, but every WordPress theme will work with this page builder. Next, we have Beaver Builder. This is another fast and stable page builder that makes it really easy to build your WordPress websites. There are a few add-ons for Beaver Builder and some themes with some demo content for this page builder. Like the rest of the page builders, it has a front-end builder that makes it really simple to build your WordPress website. Next, WP Page Builder. Although this is the youngest of the page builders, I've seen some really nice things from this builder. It's easy, it's intuitive, it's fast, and I think down the road, we can see more improvements for this builder, so keep an eye out. Lastly, Gutenberg. Gutenberg is the default editor with WordPress right now, and it's in a maturing state. There are several add-ons and plugins for this theme that work specifically for this new page builder, and I will cover all of these in another video because there are quite a lot. Now, this is the default builder that comes with WordPress, and over time, Gutenberg is really improving. So all these page builders are good picks for your website, and there really isn't necessarily the best page builder out there. There are popular ones and there are less popular ones, but find a page builder that works for you and your WordPress websites. Number 11, optimization. Sometimes by adding a simple plugin to your website, it can really help speed up your WordPress website. There's a few plugins I recommend in this category. First, asset cleanup. This plugin will prevent or disable specific scripts from loading, making your WordPress website send less requests and making your website load faster. You can also minimize CSS, reduce the JavaScript files, and disable emojis, which can slow down your website. Another helpful plugin is FastPress. Just by simply installing this plugin, it will automatically optimize your website for the fastest page settings. It's a great plugin, completely free. It also has no pro version. Lastly, Accelerated Mobile Pages. This plugin automatically adds Accelerated Mobile Pages functionality to your WordPress website, which makes your mobile visitors have a faster loading experience. It's a great way to reduce bounce rates and have your mobile visitors stay longer on your WordPress website. Number 12, e-commerce. If you wanna turn your WordPress website into an e-commerce platform to accept payments and create products for your shop, the WooCommerce plugin is hands down the leader in this industry. It allows you to create various types of products, have automated taxes, set your shipping, 
restricts specific countries from buying on your shop to prevent shipping issues, and works with pretty much every payment merchant on the internet. The best part, it's completely free. Now, if you plan on only selling digital products, I recommend the Easy Digital Downloads plugin. It's another great e-commerce plugin that allows you to sell digital products, memberships, or any other virtual products on your WordPress website. It does give you a bit more control over your shop than WooCommerce in regards to digital downloads, so I think it's a great pick if you want to start a digital download website. Number 13, Community. Do you want to create your own social website or community website? There are two plugins in this industry that are the leaders in this category. BuddyBoss is a great plugin that converts your entire WordPress website into a social community website. So this plugin allows users to come to your website, sign up, post in the news feed, create groups, create courses, upload images, and basically do everything Facebook can. Peepso is another great plugin that offers the same features with some minor differences. I will be creating a complete comparison between these two, and when I make that, I will put that in the description below of this video. Number 14, course creation. If you want to create your own online course website, the Lifter LMS plugin is a great plugin that allows you to create courses, quizzes, assignments, and you can also charge money for your courses. I really like the user interface for this plugin. I find it really easy to use for beginners. LearnDash is also a very powerful plugin. It allows you to create courses, lessons, quizzes, offer certifications, have badges, and has tons of free integrations. Either way, you can't go wrong with either plugin when you're trying to create a online course website. Number 15, custom post types. Custom post types can be confusing for beginners. Essentially, custom post types are still posts, but within a specific category. The plugin I recommend is custom post type UI. For example, you can create custom post types for library books, cars, or something that you may want to create, but it's not necessarily a post. In fact, WooCommerce products are a great example of a custom post type. They're not necessarily posts, but they're just something else. So if you're new to custom post types, feel free to give the custom post type UI plugin a try. Number 16, sharing. If you want to have a sharing icon or have users share your content, the Monarch plugin from Elegant Themes is a great plugin. The Monarch plugin allows you to create sharing icons on your website in which users can share your website to their favorite social network. It's loaded with tons of templates, and you can also design the sharing icons. You can also enable specific social websites. You can place the sharing icons as a widget, add it to the side of your page, add it to your sidebar, or even lock the content on specific posts. It's one of the more popular sharing plugins I've seen on the internet. You can also use social media share buttons. This is a great free plugin that allows you to place your social icons wherever you want. It comes with 20 designs and also has a sticky social icon bar, which is pretty cool. Number 17, email opt-ins. If you want to create pop-ups on your website where users can opt in to your email list, the Bloom plugin by Elegant Themes is a great versatile opt-in form. It allows you to place your opt-in form as a widget, pop-up, slide-in, and other various designs and styles. It also comes with hundreds of really nice templates that you can use for your website, and it also shows you the stats of how many people saw the pop-up versus how many people signed up. Now, one thing to note is the Bloom plugin, which is the email opt-in, the Monarch plugin, which is the sharing plugin, and also the Divi theme, they all come in a specific package, and I do have a 20% discount for all three of these products in the description below, so you guys can get the yearly package for 70 bucks, and again, this includes Divi, Bloom, and Monarch. You guys can also get the lifetime, which means you only pay one time and you get access to all of the plugins and Divi, and that is a one-time payment. And also I do have a tutorial that's quite popular on YouTube that goes in depth on how to use the Divi theme. So if you do wanna check this tutorial out, I will leave this tutorial in the description below of this video. If you're looking for a free alternative, you can also try Sumo Me. Sumo Me allows you to create a pop-up for your email opt-ins. You can design your forms and it also integrates with most email providers. Number 18, social login. So you've been to websites where you can log in with Facebook or your Gmail account, right? You can add this feature on your WordPress website using a social login plugin. Social login Nexus allows users to visit your website, create an account and log in with one click. It's really convenient and it's really easy for users to sign up. So this will really help you with conversions. Number 19, bookings. The Amelia Booking plugin is a great overall booking plugin. You can create a booking website for any style of niche. Users can select specific times. They can also select specific dates. They can also select specific people they want, like their favorite doctors or personal trainers. 
You can accept payments with this plugin and it also sends out text messages to customers. Plus, it looks great on mobile. You can also use the Bookly plugin. I do like this plugin, but they do offer a lot of add-ons and I think maybe they should embed all of them together to make things a little bit more convenient for users. The add-ons range from subscriptions to special days and they also have specific payment merchant gateways as well. Another plugin that's getting a lot of attention is Booknetic. This plugin comes with a beautiful custom dashboard, allows you to build your form, send out text notifications, and it also works with various payment gateways. Plus, it looks really nice. Number 20, Memberships. Ultimate Membership Pro is one of the best all-around WordPress plugins to create membership websites. You can offer free and paid memberships, restrict pages, add recurring payments, and even offer free trials for your users. It also works with 11 different payment gateways. It's a great overall plugin for a membership website. You can also use MemberPress. MemberPress allows you to create memberships, create coupons, restrict content, create specific membership groups, and also have subscriptions. It's really all about preference regarding these two membership plugins, but both have the same result. If you're looking for a free option, Paid Memberships Pro is probably the best alternative. Paid Memberships Pro has a convenient dashboard where you can see the visits, the views, and the logins on your membership website. With Paid Memberships Pro, you can create membership levels. You can also add recurring subscriptions, coupon codes, and also membership expirations. You also get access to all the payment gateways in the free version, which is pretty generous. So you can set up PayPal or Stripe or other payment gateways in the free version. The plugin comes with 76 add-ons. There are some free ones like free trials and there are other paid add-ons as well. Paid Memberships Pro is an all around powerful membership plugin to create membership websites. However, before I end the video, I just wanted to part way with three other plugins that you might need on your website, but don't necessarily fit in a specific category. Number one, really simple SSL. If you find your SSL not working properly, you can install the really simple SSL plugin. It will automatically detect your settings and configure your website to force the HTTPS to run your website, giving you that green padlock secured on your website that Google now requires. It's a great plugin to get past any SSL issues you might have. Next, ACF. ACF is a popular plugin that allows you to add custom fields to your already existing posts, pages, or custom post types. For example, if you're a real estate agent, you can create a real estate listing, then insert custom fields for those listings like price, bedrooms, baths, and description for the house without recreating the entire page again. It integrates with page builders and is a great way to add fields to any website to make the web design process real easy. I will be having a tutorial on this plugin in the near future. Lastly, Pretty Links. If you want to convert your affiliate links into a nice URL, the Pretty Links plugin is the best plugin for affiliate marketers hands down. It's a great way to track affiliate clicks, clean your affiliate links, cloak your links, and it offers other tools affiliate marketers might need to run an affiliate marketing website. I do have several tutorials on how to make an affiliate marketing website, and I will leave those in the description below of this video. All right, guys, so that is my list of the best plugins for 2021 and beyond. What did you guys think of these plugins? Do you guys use them? Have you used them on other client websites? Do they suck? Let me know in the comments below. I don't think anything personal, but I do hope this video really helped you guys out. I did my best to kind of diversify as much as possible because I want to give you guys more options and you know more plugins to explore, but at the same time also be good plugins. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And until then, I will see all of you party people in the next video, guys. Take care.